Hi, this is Jack Pollock at the IPG Media Lab. I'm here with DJ Saul of iStrategy Labs, making the internet of things a reality. DJ, can you tell us a little bit about what you guys are up to? Yeah, definitely. So we're um, we're still a relatively young five-year five-year-old agency, and uh, we've the last couple of people we hired are, are we you know under the job post of. Um, creative maker or hacker or wildcard. So we've been, we've been hiring a lot of people to be able to do some of the stuff. So at a high level, I mean, we, we're a digital agency, but as you're saying, Jack, we uh, we blend the online and the offline world. So we we like to say we hack, hack the physical or hack the physical world for stunts and promotions or installations or little pop-ups or, or what have you. So uh, last year at South by Southwest, we did the GE Social Fridge that sort of got a lot of people excited about the notion of doing this. So, I mean, in between, we've been working on everything from a, a shot bot that pours you a shot. If your email hits a certain, your email inbox is a certain uh, threshold. You get that 500th email, it'll pour you a little shot into a glass. Um, we're doing a couple different uh, plays on a vending machine. So, you know, a Twitter activated vending machine that's fully wrapped and branded and has a personality to it. And you tweet at it and it'll dispense that slot. So, sort of paying for an item or, you know, with, with social, uh, yeah. <laughs> which is kind of an interesting notion. Um, so, that, you know, we're testing that out in some corporate headquarters and then maybe release them out into wild on you know, college campuses or Times Square or, or whatever makes sense at the time. And then this last week we did the uh, paint bot where we hacked a paintball gun to shoot off when you use a specific hashtag, ISL paint, if you want to try it at home, it will fire. Yeah, awesome. Now there's also kind of an interesting visualization aspect to what you guys do. Can you tell us a little bit about that? Yeah, definitely. And, and um, you know, my, my honest opinion, this uh, it's a really interesting space. I mean, we've been doing social data visualization. We built our own proprietary platform called um, Grandstand that um, allows us to uh, more easily and more beautifully display uh, anything from Twitter, Instagram, Flickr, um, Facebook, you name it, we'll, we'll make it look cool. Um, so I, I think there's a lot of different applications for that. Um, actually, literally and figuratively, I mean, there's a tremendous amount of, of companies uh, established to the, the fledgling that are, that are sort of trying to tackle this space or uh, maybe creating different problems to then subsequently solve, but um, still something that we're, we're definitely doing a lot of. We have a couple a couple going here. Um, focus more, on, as you might imagine, on um, the the rich you know, media and, and taking something like photos from Instagram especially as more and more people use that. Uh, you know, having cool you know, album scrolling effects that are going at, at different uh, sets of intervals where people can really actually see what's happening at an event, whether they're accessing it on you know, their uh, tablet or mobile or from their desktop or they're in a physical space and they want to see very, very large you know, what people are doing. Yeah, very cool. So what's on tap for South by Southwest? Have you been doing panels, meetings, uh, yeah, seen anything um, particularly interesting? A little bit of both. So, you know, last year was very different. I was pitching up on stage and we were, you know, scrapping together the GE social fridge yeah. activation. This year we're just doing four or five, you know, really, really small things that don't take a lot of time. So I definitely, you know, uh, have a couple meetings, hanging out with, the, you know, random European kids that I haven't seen in a long time that are that are all out here. Um, yeah, otherwise I've only one, only gone to two two panels and sessions so far, which I guess is you know maybe a little bit below average. But I don't know. A lot of people come here and you know, maybe won't go to any. So, yeah, um, yeah, yeah. Absolutely cool. Well, thanks, DJ. You got. It. For more news like this, check back at ipglab.com.